Hi, I'm Doug Hannon. I'm here to show you what is probably the most amazing creation that I've ever come up with. We call it the wave cast spool. And what it's going to do is completely eliminate all of the problems, not just some of them, but all of the problems with spinning reels. And let me show you a familiar problem that just happens to be on a reel that this bank fisherman was using and left untended. And you'll see right here on this reel is the all too familiar loop hanging off the spool right there. And that thing is the devil when it comes to fishing because what happens is that line will come over that spool lip at, believe it or not, 20,000 RPM or more in a cast and snatch that loop off and all the line spooled on top of it. And what do you got? You got a huge bird nest. You might even have to change your line, but at least you'll have to cut some off. And it just ruins spin fishing. And it's something that always is there with spinning reels. What my reel does is actually completely eliminate not the loop but the problems that the loops cause because this revolutionary wave type pattern causes the line in a cast when it comes off the spool to go all the way to the top of the waves. In other words, it just skims right across the top of the waves while the loops have a place to lie out of the way down in between the waves. Whenever something goes fast over waves, it comes to the top. Whenever it sits still, it settles to the bottom. So your loops, which are stationary, hang down there in these waves and just pass right over. And what you get is a situation where the loop does not get snatched off, but comes off in the normal sequence. The loop will form across your spool like that. And as you reel on it, you'll see it there. And there's the loop. The loop on a normal spool is a big loose loop because the smooth spool can let it crawl together. But on this, all that happens is the loop just comes off in the sequence of the cast. You never throw a bird nest, and I mean never. And oh, guess what? When you ride across the tips of these waves, you hardly have any line contact or friction with the spool. And that leads to longer casts, up to 30% longer.